Glad to have you here. Welcome to the fam. Guys, today we're going to be talking about the new Pokemon that was revealed in the live stream. So, if you go back, there was a 24-hour live stream that happened. And, I'm not going to lie, I was really tired and I couldn't finish it. But, in it, it revealed that Ponyta is going to have a Galarian form. And, the way it looks right now is that there is a male and a female difference with the female having a rainbow colored kind of body and a tail and the male having kind of a paler looking body with no tail and Impidimp was also shown being a very good troll <laughs> now Ponyta is gonna probably be a fairy type because it's in Glimwood Forest we don't know anything else if it is dual type or not we, we're not a hundred percent sure there's some leaks going around that it might be but I'm going to stay away from that until they're 100% confirmed. We know that Ponyta is based off of a unicorn, based off of its design. There is speculation that Rapidash is going to be an alicorn, which I have just learned is a unicorn with Pegasus wings. Because it's seen that Pokemon are covering up something flying in the area, and you can hear Rapidash cry at the end of the stream just before it finishes. Before that, Surfetched was revealed in a 30 second trailer to be exclusive to Pokemon Sword. Do we know if Ponyta is going to be an exclusive Pokemon? No, as of right now we don't. But hopefully we'll be able to find out. If it's going to be for sword or shield, or if it's going to be for both, we, we'll find out here soon. We've gotten Zigzagoon's line, we've gotten Farfetch'd line, and we've gotten a Ponyta line. How many more Galarian forms are we going to have? Well, I believe it's going to be roughly about 17 different Pokemon, because... Sun and Moon had about the same. So can we expect about 17 different Pokemon? And that includes their evolutions. So we've got the Zigzagoon line. That's one, two, three. Linoon and uh, Obstagoon. Then we have Farfetch and Surfetch. That's five. And we have Ponyta and Rapidash. That's seven. So are we looking at ten more different Glorian forms that haven't been revealed to us? I don't know. I believe that it's going to be roughly about the same because Game Freak was working on Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon, and was getting information ready to switch over to the Switch at the same time. So we're going to probably see roughly the same amount of Pokemon as we saw in Sun and Moon get added, which is roughly about 70 to 90 different Pokemon. And 17 of them were Galarian form, or were uh, Alolan forms. So 17 will probably end up being Galarian forms as well. I guess we'll find out once the Pokemon Company reveals more information. But until then, guys, I'm glad you joined me, and I'll catch y'all later.